you have one shot if I ask the site director something. What question do you want me to ask? Or Echo Bird, which one? I've got the coin right here. The most common question I am seeing from the critical hazard assessment team is regarding the site director and the goo. And so it seems like that is what you are asking me to inquire in. Sherman. The critical hazard assessment team has an inquiry for you. Sure. It is regarding SCP-035. The company next. Indeed. All right. Apparently there has been a spread of SCP-035's toxin, it's goo if you will, across the site. Do you have any information on that matter? Any of 035's goo that may be outside of its containment chamber? No, uh, I do not. Uh, that is concerning. Uh, it is incredibly toxic. Uh, and none of it has appeared outside of the containment cell to your knowledge? We did catch the janitor with some once, but that was weeks ago. I, I don't think it should be an issue anymore. Interesting. I'd like to thank you for your service. But I'm very concerned with the issue, I have to ask one more time. If there were some of 035's goo outside of containment, why would that be the case, Administrator? It was a nice kick to my whiskey. And it also uh, helps keep me alive. Alive? I'm 500 years old. Only 500? Yeah, he's worried. Get over it, David. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Get over it, David. Get over it, David. Hang on a second. Come I, on. My come friend on. here made me realize something. Did you know how long someone has to be missing before they're pronounced dead? Did you know how long that is? Uh, it's going to take a while, I guess. Two years. It takes two years. But to someone who just admitted that they're 500, clearly six months is no time. It is a blink of an eye to someone like That's you. That's like five minutes to you, isn't it? Look, we we all thought you were dead, David. We well, had a funeral. When did you just? You. When did you? Oh, a funeral! Wow. You were so quick to jump the gun yeah. on him being dead. You waited not even the mandatory time of two years. Yeah, How, when, when, did, when did that funeral happen? When did you decide the funeral would happen? Well, I, I'm I'm sorry, David, but you were in the other world. No one has ever survived that. Well, I did. Congratulations. Yeah, but we right. really thought you were dead. Well, you didn't Look, give me the two-year quota is my point. Elizabeth was heartbroken, all right? And I just... I also know what it's like to lose someone to an SCP. I just wanted to be there. It started out completely innocuous. I I picked up her dry cleaning a few times. I took Zappa to the vet. He's very healthy. He, he doesn't like me very much. And look, it's, it's, I, don't, I don't think it's anyone's fault. That kind of friendship. We have a lot in common, you know? Did you know that she likes British Airmen? Yes. yes, we watch them all the time together. I believe we have to let an emotional moment sit in there. Are you all right? Yeah. I was just told that I have some sort of disease. Um, 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 pe pe pestilence, maybe? I, I, I don't know. I, some, something the doctor, I, I, the doctor, SCP, oh, the plague doctor. I would not take the plague doctor's word as gospel. He's been wrong many, many, many times before. That's a relief. Thank you, sir. What, 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 what's your name? You can call me Sherman. And you are? Uh, Stan. St Stan. Uh, St oh, God, I hate Stan Frumpel. Hi. Uh, head of the ethics committee here at the site. Nice to meet you, Stan. Nice to meet you, too. Can you give me a quick summary of the situation we are in currently? I, I can try. <laughs> um, it, it seems to me that the power went out. I, how? I don't know. I, I'm trying my hardest to make as many forms as I can in order to keep that from happening. And, of course, the power going out means that the SCP can come out of containment because they're no longer contained in their power... Grits, yes. Exactly. Honestly, at, at the moment, that's all I'm aware of. Uh, 
now I was just told that I have a pestilence. Um, well, let's let's get by that. He, 049 has accused many innocent people of being pestilence and killed many more due to that. Yes, that's, that's very true. It's very, very true. Um, Are there any sort of filings with the Ethics Committee, disciplinary issues on staff we should know about? On staff? Well, I, I believe that's, that is technically more HR's department. I'm more the ethics when it comes to... How are the ethics, okay, how is the treatment of the anomalies by, say, the site administrator? Does he treat them well? Does he treat them poorly? Does he treat them too well, he tries too poorly? very hard not to actually uh, physically contact, have any physical contact with the SCPs themselves. Uh, and any forms that I fill out go straight to the O5 Council. So, uh, really, I mean, yes, he is important, uh, but... I can sometimes go out of the way. Do you have personnel files on the staff members here? I do not. I, if anyone does, it would probably be... So, you couldn't tell me, I don't know, their name, date of birth, such as that? I mean, if, if, I, if I look hard enough, maybe. Uh, take a breath, take a breath. Not... N not presently, no. That that, that would be that would be in a different in a different area of the site. Unfortunately, it's in lockdown. We can't quite get to that at the moment. Are any members of your site staff 500 years old? I'm so glad to hear you say those because I've been thinking. I hope not. I've only been here for 13 years, so I don't know. Yeah, I've heard from a lot of the new recruits today that. Okay, thank you, Seth. Yes, yes, thank you. To see what might happen to us at any moment, and so. What in tarnation? No time like a containment breach, I guess. Y'all are very excited, but we saw what happened to the last person who confessed their love here. It didn't go well for Chris. Sorry, what do we have going on here? Oh, talking to someone who I thought was my fiance, if you don't mind. Oh, God. Don't you think we should see what Dr. Taylor has to say about that? My attention instead of doing your job instead of working. David, maybe I would have expected this from you, Charles. You have responsibilities. You have a job, a job that judging by the state of the site right now, you clearly failed at. Elizabeth. Oh. 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 Yes! Dr. Taylor. Ah. Sorry, Charles. Ah. I could have excused fraternizing with a doctor, giving our cat to an SCP. Even leaving me for 10 months, put all of this in the middle of a containment breach, leaving Danny behind. You're an MTF agent, David. Start acting like one. Oh, I can't really hear you from your moral standpoint of having your boss's dick in your mouth. Oh, no! Oh. 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 Get your shit together. Oh. I promise those FTPs will be the least of your worries. Oh. Yeah, Elizabeth! Well done. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Okay, back to work, everyone. I'm at my station now. I was so not cool to say to her. Oh, it's the Thank you. Thank you for listening. Site42 Studios and its staff are funded by viewers like you. Please become a patron or visit our merch store at the link in our bio to support our work. Secure. Contain. Protect.